Games play smoothly, a lot of classics under different names and some games I've never heard of. Only problems I have are you have to use the phone app to talk while online and you can use pro controllers when you do couch cooperative. Also there are 11 games that you can play when it's a single console play. Which is understandable also small gripe is that you can play multiple rounds when in single or cook playing. Once the round is over you get kicked to the menu and have to select to play a game. It's annoying but hardly a deal breaker as that games load super quick all in all I got this to play with my GF but I'm finding that I'm having a lot of fun with the single player. Plus we bowling is back. Item arrived on time and in brand new condition. Haven't played it yet because busy of work but it's from Nintendo so definitely authentic with its gameplay previews. Can't wait to play it ASAP. Have had this game a couple days now and I'm loving it so far. The gameplay is very smooth and the graphics are nice. I have only played some of the classic American games so far. Checkers, Connect 4, Last Cardano, etc. But plan on learning all of them. Only gripe so far is that some of the games I grew up playing have official rules that I never played. For example in checkers, if you can jump your opponent's piece, you have to. That's silly to me since I've never heard of that rule, but I suppose it's not possible to accommodate everyone's house rules for every game. Also it's tough to tell which games you can do multiplayer for and which ones you can't. Hopefully these will be addressed in updates. But I still gave it 5 out of 5 because come on 51 games. 52 if you count the piano for $40 that playlist nicely deserves 5 stars.